What's going on, everybody? It's your favorite dating coach, Elliot Scott. And as you can see by the title below, we're going to talk about part three of a you know four-part series, sequencing, basically, and how a lot of people make it worse and how, how, how power dynamics work when you're ahead or falling behind, okay? Basically, how it unfolds. It's important that you watch the other two videos. Again, I will have a link down to the playlist in the comments and description. So let's jump into it. A lot of people do not know how um, power works when gaining it and losing it. A lot of the times when you have it and you lose it, it is 100% your fault. Now, that sounds like common sense, but here's the thing. A lot of people think power is very, um, uh, like, it's literal. Uh, it, it's uh, like, like people think, uh, the example I have here is working out, right? So if people think of it like this, it's A, B, C, D, E. Like, you, you, if, you, if I just do these things, it, 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 it works. I can get back to where I was, like working out, right? So, you know, this day you work out, great. This day you work out, this day you work out, awesome. But let's say Thanksgiving comes around, it's like, oh, shit, I, you know, I fucked up, so I'm going to step back. Um, now I'm off it. I'm going to start Monday. You know, then you take a step back, right? But then you get back on it. Boom, boom, right? That's how people think it is with power. Uh, you know, oh, I slept with them early. Elliot, how do I regain my power? No, that's not how it works. Instead, it's more exponential where if, well, not exponential, that's not really exponential, but it's, I, I use the analogy of chess, where if you make this move, okay, right? Instead of this move, um, let's say over here, that's it's a completely different game. You're playing a completely different game. And in, in, in alternate universes, okay, if these are two chess boards, all you say three, doesn't really matter, right? If you make this move versus this move versus this move, okay, they now the game plays out a million different ways based on that move. Is, does, does that make sense? So what I'm getting at is when it comes to when it comes to dating, it's not so much the working out, right? Uh, and, and oh, I got to make the right steps and I'm back in the game. No, 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 no. If, 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 right? Here's you making the right move. Boom, 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 whatever. Here's you making the wrong move right? It's, 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 it's circles now. It's a whole, it's a whole different game. And to get back where you, you do have to play the game correctly, but to get back where you were, he has to make a blunder and you, right? So we'll say, let's, let's color it blue, right? Or whatever. He has to make a blunder and, and fall backwards. And then that's where you get the advantage. That's how it works. I, I hope I'm explaining it, it uh, in, correctly. It is hard to explain, but that's why I have this up here. A lot of people look at it very, again, it's just in line. Oh, Elliot, we're moving forward. I'm having a lot of power. I'm doing this. I'm doing things great. Boom. Boom. Elliot, we're on four dates. Doesn't matter. That, that doesn't matter if you're not playing the game correctly. So, so for example, if you're moving forward and you're, go, and you're on date four, but it doesn't feel like you're, you're, you're moving towards a relationship, you're playing the game wrong. If, it, if, if you hooked up date one, okay, if you hooked up here and you're going forward, that, it's like the butterfly effect. That's the, if you've ever seen that movie with Ashton Kutcher, that's the best way to put it. You mess something up, you're going, right? So let's say you hook up there, and let's say you don't hook up here, okay? This is where you don't hook up, this is where you hook up. You're playing, this is a completely different game now, okay? That's, the, so, so when it comes to power, the best way to not get screwed over is to watch the first two videos of the series, but it's also to understand prevention. Prevention is so important when it comes to power dynamics, because as soon as you make a mistake, it's not, oh man, I made a mistake. Uh, uh, I, I made a mistake. I, I, I have to, if I, I have to play the game correctly, 
I, and, you know, to get it back. No, because if he plays the perfect game, it's like chess. I don't know if you guys know what blunders are in chess, but a blunder is a statistically like horrible move that gave you a good position to a, a horrible position. And sometimes if it's so bad, it'll give the guy the edge, right? So let's say you make a move and you, uh, you sacrifice your queen, um, not realizing uh, like something, right? Like you sacrifice your queen. That's a huge, not even sacrifice. You just give up your queen. That's a huge, huge blunder, right? So making this move, boom, where you're winning, okay? Versus this move over here, right? Boom, and you're losing. Now, you, you have to hope, for the love of God, that this guy makes a mistake so you can get the winning position again. You have to hope he blunders. Now, what ends up happening with a lot of women is that's not the case. You, it goes back to what I said in, in, in the first video and the second video where when women start to lose power, right, they try to change up the game and they're like, change it up for a good and bad way. The good way is, you know, you still play the best you can. You made one mistake, okay, you still play the best you can and see how it unfolds and hopefully he makes a mistake. The other way is you're trying to make up for falling behind. You're trying to make up for lost time. You're trying to make up for that blunder. So you explain yourself. Get that shit out of here. You try to explain yourself. You're saying sorry. Get, again, get that shit out of here. You're, you're trying to give him an explanation on why you were acting like a fucking nut job. Uh, like all that, you're, you're, you're constantly seeking validation. Like you lose. And, 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 all, and these are blunders. These are blunders, right? These, these are, well, let me get the red here. These are blunders. So now you move over here and it's a bad move. Then you move over here, it's a bad move. It's ba again, I don't know how much you guys know of chess, but you're basically like moving your king around to survive is what you're doing. And what, and this stuff right here, like, you know, you trying to make up for lost time or you trying to make up for like the mistake is the alternate universe. You wouldn't have to do that stuff if you didn't make the mistake, right? If you didn't sleep with him early on, not saying that's always a mistake, it's just a good example, right? Like if you didn't sleep with him early on, you would be down here making the right plays and he has to, and you know, he has to figure out like what to do to catch up, okay? But because you messed up, now, let me get, now, now he's here, smiley face, you know, little evil smiley face. Now he has the power and you're making all these moves to try to make up. To try to make it right, it's an alternate universe now. It's a it's it's a completely different game you're playing. So, ladies, when it comes to transitioning power, okay, it's really important when you give it to him, you make sure the game is played correctly, meaning he deserves it. Have I messed up? Like, am I messing up? Is it moving too fast? Am I going along with things? Am I ignoring these red flags? Did I sleep with him too early? Did I give him the benefit of the doubt? Did I feel that gut in my, uh, in, or that, 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 that intuition, that gut instinct? Did I feel that and ignore it? Okay. Did I, did he not invest enough? Did I think he was different than other guys and it comes, you know, come to find out he's not like all that type of stuff. You have to question those things. You have to question those things because if you don't, and you make a mistake somewhere, okay, then he gets the advantage and it's over. Now you have to, so let me give you a great example of this. Actually, I was going to say, I was going to be done there, but let me give you a great example, right? Let me erase all this. Let me give you an amazing example that you all can relate to, right? And we talked about it in the last video too, right? So remember the last video? If you guys didn't see it, uh, uh, you know, we talk about like the first meeting, okay? Then framing for the relationship, okay, um, there, there. Then we talk about, uh, what, what, what was the next one? The courtship, okay. Then sleeping with the guy, sex basically, after sex. Um, well, it's not how you spell sex. Sex, right? Like, like, you, like, like you get where I'm going, right? So a woman has the advantage here, here, he has the advantage, here, here. Just like I talked in the last video, what a lot of people don't, like, there's a reason why the guy you're talking to 
is holding is holding out. If you move fast with him here, fast, okay? If you move fast with him here, he knows, ching, he got you. He got you. Bing. So maybe like you sleep with him on the first date. N now, why do you think he's slowing this down, this part? Like, why do you think he's slowing this down? That's just, I mean, slowing. <laughs> why do you think he's slowing this down? You rushed. You missed your opportunity. It's, it's, again, it's like chess. You had your turn. You fucked up. He took advantage of it, and now it's a slow burn. Elliot, why, or you're not Elliot. Well, you, I guess Elliot, if you're talking to me about it, why are we not progressing? Why are we not moving forward? Now you're questioning him. Now you're in your head because you gave him the power before testing it, right? Like I said in the last video, yeah, like you have to give it to a guy who deserves it, to a guy who has worked for it, to a guy who's on the same page as you, to a guy who. Um, you know, you did your background check, your detective work, and you find out, hey, he's not that bad of a guy. He's looking for the same thing as me, blah, 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 blah. Now, of course, guys can lie, but that's a whole other story. I'm not worried about that. Just do your part first, okay? But you didn't. You, sc you screwed up here. Damn it. Hold on. I know I'm, I feel like I'm, I'm, I have a lot of caffeine, so I apologize. But you screw up here, okay? You screw up. It's his turn. And he takes advantage of it and he slows it down. Let me let me get let me get a yellow for caution, right? Slows it down. He slows all this part down. Right? And you're wondering, well, what the fuck? What the fuck? So what ends up happening here? So now let's talk about their actions. What ends up happening there? He got power, he's slowing down. What's going on? Well, like I said. Like I said before, how does it play? How's it playing out? The alternate universes, okay? How how is it playing out? Because you fucked up. Well, if you look at him, okay, he's chill, uh, easy, like easy resources, easy access to you, easy access. I suppose access, I promise. I'm trying to write fast. Easy access. You get what I'm saying, right? Like, he's acting a certain way. Now, you, what are you doing? Basically, I can just write one thing. Freaking <laughs> the fuck out. That's what you're doing. That's what you're doing. You're, shit. You're freaking out. You're freaking the F out, okay? And, and you're in, basically, and your game's gonna show it. You're seeking the validation. You're trying to figure out what the fuck's going on. You're you're wanting some clarity. So therefore, you're asking a lot of questions. You're bot right, and he has the power. So he's like, yeah, yeah, bitch, I'm chilling. You're not a bitch. That's what he said. I'll get him for that. But right, he's chilling. He's chilling. This is power. Power equals whoever does less and can get the same outcome. Write that down. Power is whoever can do less and still get the same outcome. That's power. You're freaking out. He's relaxing because you made the blunder, okay? And it's it's hurting you. Now, again, to sum all this up, the whole story on this is prevention. You got to understand how right power and actions play out. If you fuck up here, right? You're not going down this path anymore. You're not going, it's, it's an alternate path now. Now it's this, okay? And I'm not saying one mistake, you're screwed. Both parties are making mistakes all the time. Just like in chess. Again, I don't know how familiar you guys are with chess. I used to play chess. But no one, unless you're at the highest, highest, highest level, even then, no one's playing a 100% perfect game. There's always plays made. Everyone's making plays better than everyone, but none of it's perfect, right? Like your play might be the third best play, you can make and mine might be the fourth but you know it's still not number one two and three so there's still or yeah there's still there's still um progress to be made whereas the next move maybe i make the best play you know and you make a second best play which is still really good but it's not better than one you know, that's how it plays out so he's while while we're going along this you know he's still making mistakes here and there and it's your job to see it and take advantage of it okay and then vice versa we're going to keep going along and, and you're going to make a mistake and he's going to try to take advantage of it that's how it is and when i say advantage of it i just mean in terms of power dynamics um so if you make a mistake ladies it's not hey elliot what do i do how do i get it back and stuff like it's different it's, it's a lot more in depth than that there's a lot of 
little little sub universes, you know, little, little ways of playing things out based on the blunder you make. So the most important thing is chill, play the best you can play after making a mistake because he will make a mistake eventually. He will. It's impossible for him not to. It's just a matter of time. He's going to make a mistake. No one plays the perfect game and it's your job to capitalize on it. Okay. So with that being said, ladies, I love you all. Take care. If you want to work with yours truly, link down below. If you want to know how to get a my high value guide, get a guy. Okay, high value um, uh, guy, a high value actions. Get him to see you as a high high value woman. Links are down below in the description. It's absolutely free. I love you all. Take care and peace.